There was once a distant land where many tales were woven about good and evil. Many times over, forces of evil attempted to conquer it. Each time, one hero was able to defeat it and save his land. This feat was accomplished with the help of one legendary sword, which was said to be the bane of all evil. In frustration, the powers of evil struck with a force unimaginable to any land past, present, or future. It is unknown to all what power was able to cause destruction of this magnitude, but one thing is for sure. The blade of evil's bane exists and is waiting for the hero's legend to grab its hilt once more and defeat the darkest of evils once and for all. As the years passed, people have wondered if the story is just that, a legend. But a new hero just might be born in this new millennium. Ah, hey bud. Uh, did you sleep well? No, I had another nightmare. Oh, I'm sorry. Well, why don't you tell me about it? I'd rather not talk about it. Well, you, you can tell me anything, you know. Uh, well, uh, I'm making omelets. How about, uh, uh, spinach and mushroom? No, um, how about a ham and cheese? Okay, th there's something on your mind. Why don't you tell me about it? Is it, uh, is it about mom? No, it's not about mom. And why do you care anyway? All you did was go off to work. And you know what? Mom has always been there for me. And now, when she is six feet under, my mother, your former wife, is gone, and now you decide to care for me? Sean, you know that's not true. I've worked very hard put food on our table and a roof over our heads. Please, please don't get upset with me. I know that things are tough. You know what? I feel like you love this mysterious job more than you loved the two of us. Sean, enough. You know that's not true. There's more to this than you know. I don't care. Sean, wait! Why don't you just listen to me for- I don't care! Dreams, huh? Care to elaborate? What are you talking about? 
I think you do know what we're talking about. And time's about up. I'm still kind of lost here. I think it'd be in your best interest to tell us what you know. Sean. <laughs> Yourself. You'll be sorry. Time's about up. What do you think you meant by that? I don't know. I've never seen those guys before. I don't know how they know I've been having... Having what? Don't, don't worry about it. You sure? That's my dad. Have you been fighting again? Yeah. And, and how long has it been since your mom passed? About five months. You know, he's probably just as sad and depressed as you are. Gee, thanks. No, I mean, like, look. Your dad might not have always been there for you, but maybe he's just looking to reconnect. Maybe he just wants to put the past behind him and move forward. What do you think? Yeah, Tommy, you're right. I'm gonna call him back. There you go, buddy. <laughs> yeah, and maybe you'll finally get some sleep. You've looked dead tired lately. <laughs> yeah, there is a reason for that. Sean, look. Firefighters have been attempting to contain the fire for approximately a half hour. If possible, please avoid the area for safety precautions until the fire is put out. Also, we advise that residents within the area evacuate the premises until further notice. nothing you can do. Just let me tell you the truth. What is it, Dad? I'm right here. <coughs> I don't have much time left. So. I'm sorry I haven't been there for you and your mother. Ever since you were a boy, all I wanted to do was protect you. For years, I've been protecting a secret. It's been a secret to everybody until now. And they tried to take it from me. Dad, you don't have to keep going on like this. We can get you to a hospital. I'm not gonna make it. Take this and go. Dad, we have time. Go. Dad, I'm not gonna leave you! You're gonna do great things. I love you, son.